Bubby. Bubby. Good boy, Tinky. Good boy. Good boy. Mil Good boy, Angel. Milton. That's my Bubby. He's my Bubby. Of course. Milton, sit. Milton, sit. Good boy, Angel. Good boy. Morning, guys. Like, today I decided to sleep in and it was exactly what I needed, but that means I am running hours and hours behind, but it's okay, because I'm still going to the gym, I'm still going to Mire, I'm still doing meal prep, but that can't start until, oh, what are we, oh, it's pink lemonade. <laughs> you guys, don't quote me on this, but pink lemonade might be my number one. Like, I know I love black cherry, but like, Pink Lemonade is a classic, and I am excited to start my day off with this. Okay, so I have my bottle opener. Leslie, I have tried. I just don't know if I can put it on my key ring. Like, as long as I have one for my car and one for my house, I should be okay. I should know where they are. Like, my keys are too heavy. I like the quick and nimble nature with which I can just get my bottle opener, get my zip this, and then we can do this. So, got my bottle opener. Also, a lot of people have been asking where they can get these. I just emailed their customer service. I looked on their website. I looked everywhere. They don't they don't have them for sale, which like BT Dub Zip Fizz, you're missing out on an opportunity here. But like, if you want one of these, just try emailing their customer service and asking for one. And while you're there, tell them that I sent you and tell them that like, Watch Autumn Keto loves her some Zip Fizz. But yes, email customer service. I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna use this and I'm gonna get my day started. Okay, let's do the, oh yeah, oh, every time, every time. I'm, I'm excited already. All right guys, you know what time it is. Grab your favorite flavor or your second favorite. Maybe you're toying with, you know, which one you like the most, but grab it and prepare to shake it. In three, two, one. to a productive day. Oh, I'm torn, it's so good, I'm torn. Woo. All right, off to the gym. So I just got done at the gym. You saw me lifting weights on the machines today. You know, it's fun to mix it up every once in a while. I didn't get to do my weightlifting program this past week because I was so busy. So I decided to, you know, put some work in at the gym. And even though I wasn't lifting heavy weights, it really allows you to concentrate more on squeezing your own muscles, which like in itself is a legit workout. So like, don't worry about doing heavy weights in the beginning. Just squeeze and concentrate on the parts that you're working at the time and you feel it. And especially since after I did those exercises, I did do 30 minutes on the treadmill on the incline and like I felt it from moment one. I will say that I did increase my starting incline to 4% this time and like I just love that I'm able to improve and eventually it's gonna be five, eventually it's gonna be six because I'm ending at an 11 incline right now and I'm just gonna crank that thing up it keeps going right okay guys so not having eggs and sausage and bacon and whatnot for meal prep like wasn't that bad it's just like I would prefer to have it but I it, it might have resolved some of my stomach issues so I'm doing it again this week just to really see if that's what it was so I'm excited because this week I am having chicken Caesar salad like I have not had salad in so long because honestly with Crohn's disease 
it's not good to have high fiber foods and the spines of the romaine they don't break down in your gut like you would expect them to and it was causing me a lot of discomfort but now that I'm all fixed I'm getting some salad back in my life so I'm making chicken Caesar salad so that's just gonna be chicken romaine parmesan I'm gonna get some hemp hearts to put on top of that some Caesar dressing and then for my snack i'm having pepperoni and some pub cheese that i got from trader joe's so i'm very excited about that uh and then for my second meal let's see okay i don't know for sure but i've been seeing meatballs all over my instagram lately and i'm like i could cook me up a nice meatball you know what i'm talking about so i might get in there and get some meatballs probably pork rind some rayos arabata sauce arabiata all them Italians out there, let me know how to say that. Um, and then some mozzarella cheese. Like, hmm, that sounds delicious. But enough talking. We gotta shop, we gotta prep, we gotta eat. On to the store. I am done with meal prep for right now. I have no idea how I'm gonna put it together, but I got me some meatballs and I got me some chicken and I'm very excited about it. I am on my way to the shop to do some work. Hopefully I don't have to stay there too long and then I will be back to wrap up meal prep. Okay guys, I am finally done for the day, so I wanna show you what I made for meal prep. For meal number one, we have these delicious meatballs. I used pork rinds and an egg, and I used some bratwurst, and I used some ground beef. Mix that all together with some spices, cooked them on the stove to get a nice little crust, and then I melted everything in the oven, just putting some of that Rayo sauce on there and some Italian cheese. I'll probably top that with more cheese when it comes out. It looks a little dry right now, but when I reheat it, I'm gonna put a little bit more pasta sauce on there and cheese, so I'm excited about that. For meal number two, yes, we have chicken Caesar salad. What? With Parmesan cheese and hemp hearts. I'm very excited about this. I bought six hearts of romaine and I'm just gonna cut them up individually right when it's time to make the salad. Also, I'm excited about this Trader Joe's pup cheese with jalapenos and pepperoni, so that's gonna be an awesome snack. And then for desserts, I got my drinks and I got my jello. 
You saw I just randomly whipped up some cold brew coffee. So guys, this is an awesome cold brew maker. It's just basically a filter in a big mason jar. I bought this off Amazon. I have linked it in my store if you wanna look in the description box below for my Amazon link. I'm just gonna be using a little bit of milk, a little bit of cream, a little bit of iris cream sweetener. And so I wanna have this first thing in the morning. Per usual procrastination style, I have not calculated my macros yet, so I don't know what all I'm gonna be having. I know for a fact that I'm gonna be having meals one and two, but I can play around with the snacks. Maybe I can have half a serving of pepperonis. Maybe I can have one and a half servings of pepperonis. Maybe I can have two tablespoons of heavy cream in my coffee. Maybe just one. So I haven't done that math yet, but I'll have it on my What I Eat Wednesday. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly what I eat Wednesdays, monthly weigh-ins, monthly keto crate unboxings, and the occasional product review and recipe. You can also find me on Instagram and Facebook at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks and I'll see you next week.